Hey everybody, Jerry here from Android Central, and we're taking a quick look at the new Near Field Communications that's uh, built into Gingerbread. You do need to have a phone that supports it. We've got a Nexus S here, and if you pull the battery door off, you can see there's two contacts right beside the SIM card. And if you take a look at the battery door, these contact points line up with those springy contacts. And this area here is some sort of antenna magic. I'm not sure exactly what they've got going on in there, but that's where it does your scanning, receiving, sending, whatnot with near field communications. Every phone's likely to be a bit different. That's how it's done on the Nexus S. I wanted to show that to you guys. So we've got to put the battery door back on and make sure it's all good and tight. Get it fired up here. And you go into the settings under wireless and networks and you scroll down to the bottom. You'll see you now have a entry for NFC. It says use near field communication to read and exchange tags. If you've got that checked, your NFC antenna is active. So we've got it checked. Let's go back here. And I have got my Visa card and I've got it all taped up so you goons can't figure out the number. And give it a little swipe. And there we go. It comes up unknown tag type. Uh, this is new. It's got a lot of work yet to be done by Google and third parties. Uh, Thankfully, it doesn't read any information off my Visa card. I don't want it to read any information off my Visa card. There's going to be a lot of privacy issues that are going to need sorted out here. To be honest, I can see something like, in my case, uh, the Chase application will work with near field communications. And once it's got my proper credentials, knows exactly who I am, then I can exchange data with my card or maybe I'll be able to use my phone at the gas pump and swipe it and pay for you know, $10 worth of gas down at the 7-Eleven or whatever. But for now, this is what you get, unless you're in Portland. In Portland, they have passed out a bunch of tags that the Nexus S can read, passed them out to restaurants and whatnot. But for the rest of us and the rest of the world, this is something you can do now. If you've got a Nexus S and a card that has blink or any type of uh, NFC communication on it. I know it's not much, but it is new and it's neat and we wanted to show it to you guys. So there it is. I will talk to you all later. You all have a good one.